Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Thrifts by Chi. Let's go thrifting. I actually went to Chicago for a family trip and I decided to go thrifting because I heard that a lot of thrift stores in Chicago are really cool, so I wanted to explore it. And here's the view from my hotel. It was gorgeous. Chicago is known for their summers. So I went to the local Goodwill, which again, I don't normally like Goodwills, but the Valley Village was too far from my hotel, so I decided to give this a shot. I went with my cousin Patrice and my sister and Keiji. Now here's the entrance to the Goodwill. It was a lot of people here and I couldn't even get a car into halfway through my trip. So I wanted to look for a plain black shoulder bag because I noticed I didn't have that in my closet, but I didn't really find one on this fifth trip, but I saw a lot that I maybe could use as a crossbody, but I decided not to get any of them. Comment down below if you like any of these black bags. I did find this coat shoulder bag, but it had way too many stains, so I decided to leave it, but it was a really good price. The one thing I really do like about Goodwill is they have really fair prices. I feel like Value Village has gone up way too much in the past years. Next, I found this gorgeous beaded bag. I thought this screamed me, and I love the colors. It looked vintage, but also it looked new at the same time, and the price was so good, so I picked it up. I also saw this Chanel dupe. They actually have a limited edition bag selling for over $7,000, so I had to pick this up. It's a perfect dupe. I decided to go to the shirts and jackets section, but I really didn't see anything. I was pretty disappointed. And also here's the overview of the store because I didn't show you guys at first. I found this green bomber for my sister. It was her size, but she didn't really like the bomber jacket, so I didn't pick it up for her. I found this really cool puffer long coat but it had way too many stains so I decided not to get it. Next I went to the dress section. I really like thrifting dresses because I feel like it's so easy to wear a dress instead of picking out a top and pants and I'm like in between sizes right now. This Goodwill actually didn't have a lot of dresses for me. It was more smalls and mediums, not really large and extra larges. This specific Goodwill was actually organized by colors and not by sizes, which is sometimes frustrating because I have to look through every item just to find my size. Also, they have the shoes on top of the clothes, not just the shoe section. So I had to like look at the clothes and the shoes at the same time. I really like these ankle booties, but I feel like they were going to be really uncomfortable, so I decided not to get them. I found these gorgeous Ugg boots, but they weren't my size, but I wanted to show you guys how you can find so many different brands in the thrift store. Now on to the skirt section. I found this gorgeous suede blue skirt and later on in the try-on, I'll show you how it fit. I found these really cool tan shorts and the price was really good. And again, you'll see them in the try-on section. I 
I found these gorgeous Banana Republic flats that have never been worn. Originally, they were $119, and Goodwill was selling them for $10. I actually had these in high school, but I gave them away because I didn't like them anymore. But then I found these brand new ones, and I was like, should I get them? Sam Edelman, but I decided not to. Just showing you guys some more brands you can get at the thrift store. These were Kate Spade, but they were too beat up for me. They had a lot of booty shorts, y'all. Chicago loves booty shorts, I'm not sure. Comment down below if you like these red shoes. I did, but I decided not to get them just because I think they were a little too... I don't know, loud for me. Pretty sure these were fake and I asked my cousin and my sister and they really couldn't tell. Now to the try on section, I found this romper but it was a little too short and a little too tight so I decided not to get it. I really like when the inseam is pretty long, like 32 to 33. And this was like a 31, maybe even a 30. So it was way too short for me. I do not do high waters. Next, I found this really cool skirt. And guess what? Wait until I turn around. It has a slit. And it's giving body, legs, and hips, and body, body. Let me <laughs> Oh my god. I found these really comfortable Nike yoga pants. I have some similar at home and I needed another one and I can't believe I found them for less than $10. The shorts were way too tight, unfortunately, but I love the color and I love that they were cargo style, but I didn't get them. The skirt was also way too tight, which was really frustrating because I thought it was gorgeous. It would have been perfect for the fall and the winter, but I didn't get it. My cousin actually found this gorgeous bodysuit. I love the fringe. I feel like you can dress it up and down, so I decided to get it. This bag was way too dirty, but I thought it would have been a cute work bag. So I'm back at my hotel now, and this is what I decided to get. The gorgeous beaded handbag. I'm obsessed with it. Then I got the Chanel dupe. It was only $10. I also got the traditional Asian purse. And here are the shoes I got. The Banana Republic flats were originally $118, but I got them for $10. I also got the items that I said I liked in the try-on section, but I already put them in a plastic bag because I didn't get to wash them at the hotel. Thanks again for watching another thrift haul. This time I went to Chicago. So I think from now on when I'm traveling, I'm gonna to try to at least go to one thrift store to show you guys how I thrift in different cities. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And see you next time. Thrift Spy Chi. Mm -hmm.